everyone. About tomorrow match, regarding that, uh, I'm a little bit worried because after the final uh, Malaysia Cup, you know, this is normal even players uh, is a little bit empty, uh, not maybe physically but uh, physical, psych psychically because we lost and uh, we we gave our our best in that that match but we lost for tomorrow match i expect uh, same like first first leg uh, in uh, bali tough match uh, bali bali is good team the last 2 3 months they improve uh, they they had better result uh, position 2 i think in uh, indonesia league uh, we have our quality also, I believe, in my team and uh, my main intention is to put in the team ready players. Who is ready for tomorrow match uh, because of injury, because of uh, psychical situation, but uh, I know my players is uh, strong enough. Uh, like uh, our coach said, like uh, uh, the last two, three days, uh, we all the players we go all out to, to the final because the final and, and the FC Cup is it, it was our priority still. So uh, for, for tomorrow, like I could say, we are going all out, no matter what, who is going to play. It's a, it's a question of they get the three points. So we are ready and and tomorrow we see what, what will happen. Hi, Coach. I from So just now you mentioned about the injuries. So maybe you can speak for players. And any suspension for tomorrow match? Uh, we don't have any suspension. Only injury from the last match, you know, Ubai is out. Azam Azmi also. Last few months he has the problem with knee, and uh, he go yesterday to Kuala Lumpur to check with the national team doctors. And uh, situation is not good, but uh, I think he, he will not join today to the training. Afternoon uh, we have the last training, and I will be decide who will be start. Uh, Azam Alif. Also, before uh, from months ago, he's injured. Uh, Safan will be okay, and uh, Shahnur Lizam. Uh, only that two, three players, I think, is uh, out of uh, squad for tomorrow. Uh, rest of them, I think, will be ready. Is that a big deal for you, Coach? Of course, every match is important. Uh, we want to keep our, 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 our stage in, in that group. Uh, Without any loss, unbeaten, we try to be that. If, of course, it's possible uh, to win if it's possible. I forgot to say yesterday, Ivan Mamut also is not training because he uh, don't feel good. I don't know what's happened, but uh, he go afternoon after the training to uh, infusion in the hospital. Coach, uh, based on current situation in a group team, uh, it's a bit like a mission impossible for Trigano to qualify. Uh, you know, when we look at the, the, the table, we can win, but uh, we don't uh, depends about ourselves. If uh, if Mariners beat uh, in in uh, Philippine uh, against Talion, they will be number one in the group. I'm a little bit sorry because of that. Uh, we take four points for for uh, from from Australian team, but we make mistake at home. Uh, against Stalion when we play draw because all that teams Bali and uh, Stal uh, Mariners they, they beat both team, both matches against uh, Philippine team but we we make that mistake we, we we play draw and that two points is different now they we, we miss that two points tomorrow uh, Central Coast Mariners and Laguna will play Ali so that result on that match will it affect the team okay we will be full of that match of course but we must look to ourselves. Uh, I always, uh, I always say that we must be on a maximum level. We play for ourselves. Uh, if his result in um, Philippines may be good, but this is nothing if we are not good. Oh, sorry, your expectation for tomorrow match? Yeah, <clears throat> normally we, we all the players we expect to win because especially when you play home, we, we will have our people. Our family will be there, so uh, I think last game in the UFC, UFC first uh, group stage, like I could say, we want to win all the games to keep unbeaten, but uh, you know, 
we cannot look like what the others team do. First we have to do well, then after we can see for the others. But like uh, tomorrow we all expect to win because uh, this game is very important also for us, for the club, for everybody. Well, how do you rate the chances maybe to qualify for the next round? Yeah, it looks like difficult, like everybody sees it, but uh, like I said, first we have to win. So we don't have any other choice to win tomorrow. But he came to Trinidad uh, like and nothing to lose. So is there pressure for more about Trinidad push or how? Yeah, you know, every match is some pressure. If you play Super League, if you play FC Cup uh, or, or final, semi final, this is normal. Uh, this is our job. Uh, every match is uh, some pressure. But this is our job and we must uh, play and work under that pressure. This is normally and uh, tomorrow we, I, I can promise, we give the, our best in that moment. We will see how we will look tomorrow. Maybe uh, any words to Trenton fans who come to stadium tomorrow? Number one, I want to say thank you for all of them, uh, for all season, not only for the final uh, a few days ago in Buki Jalil, all the season. They follow us and uh, again, thanks to them and uh, I call them to help us tomorrow to, to beat uh, that match against Bali. From the, from the first match of the season, they were with us and we all know without fans, there is no football. So we expect them to come to full house, not full house, but to come to support us tomorrow and, and, and share for us to get what we want. Regardless of what ever is up tomorrow, how do you see your performance in this first Season. Uh, you know, uh, every coach give his uh, hundred percent every every match, every training. Uh, I'm same like like other coaches. Uh, of course, uh, selection is number one. Now I I know better to my player than on beginning. And if you look uh, first eleven, maybe how we start in in uh, on beginning of season now is a little bit different. We. And okay, not, not only me, I and my my uh, staff. We improve some players, but that player deserve that. We put some young players uh, in first eleven. People ask how can play. I don't. I don't care who is the foreigner or local. I look who is the better in that moment. We talk about quality. Football is quality. Of course, some other things like character, like uh, fitness, everything, and. Uh, during the season, some foreigner has uh, like Sardar Kumat of long injury a few times, and they lost position in the team. In that moment, I must re my re re react with some other solution, and we do something. And uh, during the season, I think we grow up a little bit, not so much, but we grow up, and we uh, put on the new stage some new players. I think one of the best thing you have done here is to develop one of the greatest back, local backline. How do you see the potential of Malaysian local? Uh, you know, I don't want to divide men too much uh, any individual, but we are team. And I said that uh, local player in that moment when we decide uh, they take that chance, play good. Uh, but uh, some situation ask to we change something, you know, result, injury, suspension, and uh, for the Malaysian football, because of that, I want to maybe comment that final. Uh, Malaysian football is not only G GDT or Selangor. Many good players, young players in some other clubs. In Terangano, we have the five, six, seven very good young players, which can be future of Malaysian football. On the positive. Uh, feedback from the fans. How do you think you can uh, repay them all the support from the start of the season? Um, I think it's only by winning because the fans, they don't care how you play. They want to win all the time. So for me, if tomorrow we go there, we win and next game again we win, I think that will be the best gift for them.